Hey guys, so I want to make a quick little speed comparison, an early speed comparison between the iPhone 6s versus the Nexus 6P. And the reason for this uh, early speed test comparison is that the Nexus 6P is now having an Android N version that was released, uh, the developer preview that was released a couple of hours ago. So of course, this is um, an early comparison, like I said, with the official version or with more developer previews. I'm going to do these videos again. So yeah, just to see uh, roughly uh, how these device stacks up against each other, you know, iPhone 6s, of course, iOS 9.3 beta is installed. So I think I do have like a beta, public beta one, or maybe it's like public beta two, but I'm pretty sure it's the beta version. We don't have 9.3 officially released. So I'm just gonna quickly boot both of these two phones up at the same time. Obviously Nexus 6P has a unlocked bootloader course without a unlock bootloader you can't install the Android N so let's see here there you go iPhone 6s faster when it comes to booting up that's that's you know pretty obvious you know uh, if you're a subscriber you know that and generally you should know that Snapdragon 810 devices take some time to boot up and it's not Android N problem of course but I think it's it's improved compared to marshmallow it took less time there so I'm just gonna unlock it so you can see here this is how they look like of course you can see Android beta program iOS Android two completely different uh, systems we have uh, they included a bunch of new features here with the Android and so you can check my channel out for a full review I also installed it on my Nexus 5x so yeah it's not available for the Nexus 5 it's available for 5x and 6b and I think Nexus 9, uh, so there's just some few compatible devices at the moment. So uh, we're gonna just test out some system-based applications. Uh, we're not gonna install any apps or use any apps from the Play Store because obviously optimization issues, you know. So um, let's just quickly go into, set, into the settings here, into the general about device. And if I increase the brightness a little bit, okay, and show you guys that this is the um, iOS 9.3 version and this is Android 7 or I mean N maybe it's, it's gonna be called that 7.0 who knows this is Android N okay, so everything is closed in the background so let's go ahead and launch some system based applications uh, so I'm not gonna be uh, opening up some temple run or other stuff you know because they are pretty new, especially this one is, is new, so I can't test out those applications, might have some bugs. And let's see here, let's start off with the phone dollar first of all, here we go. Oops, my bad, let's see here, do it again. Hmm, seems like the iPhone is a little bit slow when it comes to, you know, animations, um, because this Android N has faster animation speed or yeah, animation speed compared to Marshmallow. So uh, let's see here if we can try out the, um, let's see, what else? We do have settings. Very, very equal. Let's see here, clock. I think just uh, slightly faster, seems to be slightly faster on the iPhone a little bit. Let's see here, we do have Messenger versus iMessage. Absolutely equal. Okay, let's go back and launch Play Store versus the App Store. And of course, Wi-Fi is connected, same on both phones. And you can see the Nexus 6B started to load faster, but the iPhone 6S finished off just as equal compared to the Nexus 6B. And uh, let's see here if we can launch camera on both phones. Here we go. You can see iPhone 6s a little bit faster. Let's launch YouTube. So I do have it here on both phones. Here we go. And seems like iPhone 6s slightly faster. Let's load a video. Okay, I'm just gonna search something. Let's search the channel name. All right, same thing here. See, take care. Okay, so I'm gonna play a video. This one, Let's see which is going to be faster. It's 
slightly faster again on the iPhone. So yeah, I mean, talking about a beta comparison wise, iPhone 6s does perform better. Of course, uh, like I said, with the official version, we will have different results. And uh, uh, let's do a quick browsing test. We do have Safari on the iPhone versus Google Chrome on the Nexus 6B. Okay, so first off is gsmarena.com. We go. Wow, interesting. Nexus 6B loading the web page faster. Let's open up this article. Okay, again, faster on the 6B. Let's go back at the same time. 3, 2, 1. And I think that was just a tiny bit faster on the iPhone 6S. But, but yeah, both are looking very smooth. I mean, even for the beta, I think they're performing way too awesome. Next off is WWE.com. See here, again, Nexus 6P, slightly faster, and both are still loading the full web page, of course. Let's load this um, article, this one, and you can see slightly faster on the iPhone 6S with the thumbnail loading. Let's go back. Again, it seems to be faster on the iPhone 6S. So yeah, just a quick little uh, speed comparison between these two phones. And let's do a multitasking uh, test here for a bonus, you know, um, and see how good this will be. Okay, loaded up nicely, no problem whatsoever. Oops, I accidentally closed the browser, so it doesn't matter because we just opened it up. So I'm gonna open settings now, now refresh. Timer, wow. I mean, Samsung should learn something here with the beta Android N, you know. Okay, so open this one again. Wow, no problem. So open YouTube. Extremely good performance on both phones. So yeah, even though they are betas, uh, but still looking very promising neck and neck performance there. So yeah, just a quick speed test between the um, iPhone 6s with iOS 9.3 beta versus the uh, Nexus 6P with the new Android N version. So uh, do let me know in the comment section down below what you think about this new Android version. And yeah, if you're interested in installing this, please check my channel out for a tutorial. And I'll see you guys in my next one. Peace out.